Hello and welcome back to the Chill Crew. We are making an absolutely absurd amount of money right now. We have troops that are equal to where we were last time, but we are reinforcing up to 27,000 troops, which is lovely. Our capital is maybe one of the most insanely good capitals in the game. We're at like almost 15 uh, gold in tax, which is just insane. Not including the fact that we're making another three and another one off of the side ones on the capital. And we have another duchy, which is also making us money. This is just great. We're in a very good spot. A spy master came to me for discovery. This person's been plotting against my mother. Hmm. My brother-in-law, huh? Well, uh, we will let the traitor be known to all. Uh, okay, notable guests has arrived. I don't care. Right, carrying on. Ooh, lots and lots of money coming in here. Uh, sway, I don't need to do it. I'm not going to pay money for swaying. Let's just keep going. We're basically just trying to get a diplomacy up so we can get to true ruler. That's where the game really starts for us. Um, we already know that Burgundy is pretty much secure. His wife is... He has a new wife who's 17. Oh, no, 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 no. This is bad. Because the wife is 17, that means that he could potentially have a child. If the child is a male, well, that's going to cause us problems. He, this guy needs to die. Yeah, murder. I gain stress because I'm honest. Well, you know. I gain more stress if he wasn't dead. Pay some money to Savoy. That puts us at 41. Uh, that's 73. And that is up to 100. Yes, yeah, so we just got 100 power. Also invite this 19 just in for a little bit of security. I'm overwhelmed by stress. Okay. I am become profligate, which lower, lowers my monthly income. I can become a flagellant, which would also wound me. Or I can just gain some stress. I think I'll just gain some stress. Then, I don't know, maybe call a hunt. Sure. Sounds good. Scheme discovered. Uh, oh yeah, so my brother is plotting against my mother. How many people are plotting against my mother? Hunt, illegal prey. Um, poachers here in Duchess's woods, they huddle together as a ride of my guards, making a poor job of hiding the dead stag behind them. We did not do this to your mercy. Uh, their blades and bows belie their um, words. Uh, I can say they're excellent bowmen, so I can get a uh, prowess. Uh, chance I gain gold if I say the animal's mine, or I get punished poachers, which increases my money but lowers popular opinion. Uh, I'll just gain two prowess. That's fine. We return invigorated. I got some prestige. Can I host a feast? No, it's unavailable because I'm missing 109 gold. That's fair. Somebody will probably invite me to a feast soon, anyway. That's kind of what happens when you're uh, the emperor. Uh, let's see. Host feast. There we go. I'm no longer overwhelmed by stress. All I need to do is host a hunt and a feast. It's good. Hey, welcome, friends. How are we looking here? Five months till the guy's dead? Great. My wife has lowered my stress by 40%. I got a huge health boost because I've spent time with somebody I care about. And, um, yeah. That's just... She likes me better. Disaster strikes. Uh, I will lose 75 prestige for 150 gold. That's fine. Fourth in line to inherit the canaries. Well, we knew that was going to... Or, yeah, we knew that was going to happen. Just generally, because we had it before. So if we give it away, we're probably in line to it. Right. Oh, wait. I see. We, got, we lost it in inheritance. So even, yeah. So of course we're in line to it. Um, some things are being built around the place. I guess to part, I gain prestige. And everybody who is at the feast likes me. That's good, isn't it? Of course, I'm going to accept the feast because we're a little bit high on stress. Let's see. Uh, I can get a weak favor on somebody. Sure, let's do that. Let's get a favor in his opinion of me goes up. Uh, conversation partner. I can get had an interesting conversation for diplomacy and learning. Wonderful. And then our stress goes down. Meal to die for. We will, of course, kill him with a meal. That bird became the last thing Andre ever ate. Also seems that none of my agents are under suspicion, which means no one can trace the poison back to me. He is dead, which now means my wife holds um, Burgundy, which is great. My son is heir. 
we should be able, we should hold an alliance just automatically. Yeah, we do actually hold. What did I? How did I get this open? What? I didn't even know you could do that. Anyway, um, so we now have an alliance, which is great. So that's another 9,000 allied to me, which will hopefully help other people when they're considering whether or not to attack me. Um, air is the same. Yeah, this is great. And she loves me. She thinks I'm brilliant due to loyalty and respect. Oh, okay, cool. That seems great. It should say air in line to inherit titles. Yeah, in line to all of that, which is sweet. I love it. Right. Uh, speed it up to max. Let's go. Anything new in here? Uh, send two can marry. So this is my half brother who's trying to kill my mother. Uh, you can marry this person. Sure. Why not? Sounds uh, good to me. Right. Money's coming in. What happens? I mean, that's going to be great to eat at some point. Uh, here. Convergent blood, chance of reinforcing congenital traits, I think was where we were going with this. Yeah, let's, let's keep going down that path. It sounds good. Nothing in there. Uh, anybody? Uh, we don't have a border. I was going to say anybody in there want to be eaten. But I guess not. Uh, Paris, do we have any upgrades? Uh, yeah, we can upgrade this one. Perfect. Anyone where else we can upgrade? Well, this one we can make, I don't know, manor houses. Sure, that makes us a reasonable amount of money. Uh, that's good. This one, we can upgrade to hunting grounds. Perfect. Says we should be reinforcing quite a few a month. I don't know if that if we always do reinforce as much as it says a month. But maybe because this number fluctuates up and down. Hey, Steven has come of age. He got level 3 in his education, which is great because that's roughly what we expected him to get. Because uh, that's what his educator had. Let's see... Hmm, who do I want him to marry? I could marry Alba's... Wait a second, what's your succession law? <laughs> what is your succession law, mister? It's, it's male preference partitions. Why is this your heir? Why is this guy your heir? Let me work this out. Are you married? Yeah, you're married, you're married. Well, that's not going to help. But I'm trying to figure out why this guy is the heir. I mean, I guess if I go in here, I'd have a better chance of finding it out. Pan to Dynasty Head. So, it would go skip, 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 skip. Skip, 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 skip. Down here, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's got a different succession law. If I go into here and then go in. Ah, it's Tanistry Elective. Never mind. Nothing we can do with that. Bavaria, uh, your heir is this dude who's 28. Does he have any children? Yeah, but he has two daughters. That's fine. Then it's this dude who has two sons. Yeah, it's a problem. I don't want to go that deep. Uh, I just want to kind of go superficially into here. What's happening under this way? I don't really know what's happening under there. Some weird stuff's happening. You? Uh, let's see, you're wrong religion, but your heir is this guy. Then you've got princess here. Could you marry my son? Will not accept because different faith. Yeah, I kind of thought that might be the case. Uh, Bavaria's not a bad one. Hamburg. Primary heir is his son. His son has four sons. You see, this is hell. Son has four sons, which then, yeah, leads to problems. I think Bavaria is not a bad share. I think if we could marry one of these Bavarian princesses. Never mind, can't do that. Hmm, maybe should have thought about this earlier. Yeah, it seems to be a common theme uh, presenting itself here. You know what? Maybe I just marry for, um, maybe I just marry for a trait. Yeah, maybe instead of marrying for any particular alliance this time, I marry for a trait. Inheritable traits. Um, let's see. Inheritable traits sort by sum of stats. Yeah, this Carling is a genius. Has great stats. Would be a perfect marriage. He He's 16. She is 18. Gets us an alliance with Danberg, which is underneath Hamburg. Perfect. This seems great. Chance of getting hail and genius. And because it's our house, there's a higher chance it will go in. And because she's a Carling spin-off, there's probably a um, 
They, they probably also have something going on. Let's wait for that to go through. Perfect. Um, so my son is now married. If I go and check Carling and open Legacies. Carling gets kin all the way down. Yeah, okay. That's pretty good. No prowess lost from age. Increase with skill. Oh, there we go. Blood. Yeah. So, congenital traits are definitely, like, all in with the Carling. So, they're going to get good ones. And they also have law as well. Like, they just have so many bonuses. You should just play as a Carling all the time. This is easy. Yeah, okay. This, that's, that, that is completely easy mode. Okay. Anyway. Essentially, what I'm getting at is they've both got a bonus chance of getting good congenital traits. So, there's a very, very good chance of children. And... She's got extra uh, fertility, so good chance of getting children quickly. This seems good, yeah. I, I think that we're on a good path. Designate a guardian for my daughter. What's she doing? She's doing intrigue. You know what? You can do intrigue. You can be educated by my, my new daughter-in-law. Perfect. I like that. Uh, let's do some more building. So this one, can't upgrade anything. Next thing I could upgrade is the castle. Don't have it. Is everything else missing money? Missing money. Yeah, both of those are missing money. We need 450 before we can do anything. Uh, I don't need to go to your thing. Don't need to worry there. Nice. I think we're in a good spot. Still need our diplomacy thing to go up a little bit. That'd be lovely if it would. Hey, our level of fame went up. That's neat. Ask our head of faith for gold. Of course. What else would you do if you're head of faith? And then I can use it to upgrade my holdings. Which will then cost me gold. Which I can then put me low enough so I can ask my head of faith for more gold. It's just the way it is. I think we just expanded. I think one of our vassals just took some land. Yeah, Granada is smaller than it used to be. Hey, we just lost 40 strength. Uh, 40 uh, stress, sorry. That's nice. That's what I like to see. We're just expanding without us even doing anything. Rise of the Mongols. Huh. Yeah, I'm sure that won't cause any problems over there. <laughs> to be fair, the Mongols are, like, got a 0% chance of causing us problems. Because the Byzantine Empire has created a wall across the world <laughs> between us and them. So, they would have to get past the Byzantines before they even get to us. Which isn't going to happen, so, I mean, we're fine. Versailles, we'll, up uh, we'll upgrade one of these here. Yeah. This one, we'll upgrade that. Cool. Diplomacy thing. Wonderful. Uh, let's grab Praetorian Guard, which means that we're one off true ruler, which is great because it means we can start vassalizing people. Uh, let's see. I stand above my subjects as a sovereign ruler, unequal in the realm. Dressing the part of resplendent garments and jewelry would serve as a subtle reminder to everyone that I'm in charge. So I can get resplendent raiment, which gives me diplomacy plus two. Local fashions, so that's a challenge, or again, 100 piety. I think I take this, even though it gives me like 44 stress and makes me bankrupt. I still think it's the correct move. Yeah, I think that's the correct move. I cannot ask the Pope for money. You sure? That's what I check. Uh, not offer vassalage, although he's not that far off. Uh, I wanted to see like, can I get like ask for gold? Unavailable until the 4th of September. In two years' time. Oh, okay. Well, we're still going to gain money. Like, very quickly. Not going to do anything there. Whoa, you want me to join you in the Baba Yod's du jour war for... Who are you attacking? Who are you? What? what? Why do we even have an alliance? Because my half-brother married someone... I'll accept. I don't want to, though. I don't want to go to war. Sounds like that's go. Uh, that sounds like that'll be work. I don't want to work. I just want to conquer places in peace. Right. Let's raise up these troops. There we go. March over there. Kill them. It was like you're not gonna win. And it went. Oh, you've got two armies. Oh, never mind. You're good. Yeah. Uh, nothing we need to worry there. We can usurp the Duchy of Tuscany. Really? Okay. Zoom out. 
grab there to see who who's actually the main person in the war you are so they're they're on one of his I want you to go there I want you to go there perfect siege down is two bits four years two years okay that's fine I'm sure it will go quicker than that maybe it might actually take that long we're losing money uh no we're not there we go we're making money 1.5 i do require the pope to give me money though <laughs> at some point hey they, they finished that siege perfect joan came of age nice joan joan you're gonna go marry matrilineally you're gonna marry i don't know this guy ma matrilineally sure sounds great I formed an alliance with this random group of people. I think they're a mercenary company. I don't think that's an actual alliance though. I think that's weird. The lure of language. Uh, so why do I gain stress? I only gain stress if I lose. So I guess I'll tire a tutor and then I have a very low chance of gaining stress. It does cost me 300 gold though, which is a little annoying. I guess I'll take the 40% chance. Okay. Tony Troubles. Uh, I can lose 10 stress. I can have a fat. I don't want to be a drunkard. I'm just going to lose 10 stress and hope that that works. It all works out for the best. We took this. Can we end the war? Uh, oh, I ransom this person to 10 gold. Definitely. Child of my dynasty. My daughter in law has given birth to a son, Martin. And now. The war is over. We gained a stress level because we failed our language stuff. Well, uh, I'll keep trying, because it might give me uh, diplomacy. Child of my dynasty. Birth to a son, Stephen. Definitely. And uh, nothing in here. Right. Now we're making 67 a month, and all of our problems have gone away. I gave up. Oh, okay. It's fine. I can't do a hunt or anything else, because I don't have the money yet, but we will have soon. Uh... Oh, I can't do one until December of this year anyway. Might be able to ask the Pope for money soon, though. That'd be sweet. September? Yeah, of course I'll ask you for money. <laughs> Are you crazy? Why would I not ask you for money? It's the best deal ever. Um, I, I can do the hunt in December. Hey, we have another cadet branch. So this is a chat. Oh, this is my brother. Daniel created a cadet branch for... Oh, for Grand Canaria. Perfect. New steward needed. This guy's not that bad. What's our best? Yeah, I'll take 13 if our best is 15. That's fine. Don't need to worry in there. We can usurp Tuscany. What does that get us? Uh, Well, it stops this guy being the Duke of Tuscany, which is sweet because he no longer is a Duke. He does hate me, though, because he desires all these things. But whatever. We'll, we'll eat him soon. Oh, I've stopped swaying this guy because he's at 100 opinion. And the faction disappeared. Lovely. Uh, Liberty faction? Yeah, sway this dude. Right. That's fine. Uh, let's do some upgrades. We'll upgrade this. Hey, we're at 27,000 now. Upgrade that. Uh, can't upgrade because I'm out of money. Alright, but we could upgrade if we had some more money. Wonderful. Right. Oh, it's all going together. We had a mental break. Uh, I think I'm just going to... What's contrite? Lowers our intrigue. Uh, I'll just take the 31 stress. That's okay. Because we're about to lower it by doing this. We should lower it slightly. Smallpox. Oh, good. Um, We will let the peasants use the forest. Uh, and that increases popular opinion. Sure. I lose money, but everyone's happy. And I gain prestige. Wonderful. I'd love to do a feast. When can I host a feast? April. Okay. March. April. It was April 30th, so it's actually May. That's okay. And none of those matter. Let's chuck in a feast. Lower stress. See if we can lower it a little bit more. Uh, so what a feast, an excellent opportunity for my son and heir Stephen to learn more about the people that serve us. Hmm, Stephen dislikes me, but these two like me more. Or these people like Stephen. 
Uh, which one's stronger? This guy has... Oh, sorry, that's Steven. This guy is by far stronger, so Magreb. Yeah. So we'll get them to like each other. Smallpox, a new day. Uh, I break a smallpox which has ravaged my court is finally over. Oh, wonderful. Good to know. Uh, I learned of someone's non-believer secret. That's fine. Disaster strikes. I can spend 300 gold to get everyone to like me more. Seems good to me. Right. 70 more gold coming in every tick. And we become an eager reveler. Everybody likes me, but eager reveler is good because it gives me diplomacy intrigue. And we'll make it so that when we go to feast, we gain more stress, uh, or we get more stress burned off, which is good. Hey, stress burns off. Nice. Uh, I'll grow a friendship with this person. My wife is pregnant. Oh, and I gain the diplomacy perk, which gets us true ruler, which should immediately unlock some vassalizations, hopefully. Oh, um, yeah, I'll just choose this one. Get lose stress. Uh, we need some spy mastery. This can be my... Yeah, it can be her. That's fine, my daughter-in-law. I'll then send her some money. Perfect. So she loves me. Let's see what else we got in here. Um... Hmm. So nobody wants to join us immediately. Let's see if we got any options. Like, Granada? I just want to see. Vassalization, minus 31. If I send him a gift, he gets 67 opinion of me, which is sweet. He's 7 off. Let's, uh... I can't sway him? Oh, because he's 10. Yeah, okay. But we can get Granada soon. Let's see. Tuscany? If I take their... If I usurp the Duchy of Tuscany... What's going to happen is he will no longer hate me for holding these holdings because I will be the rightful one and I'll be his de jure liege. So yeah, I think if we take Tuscany, I think we just usurp it. Our vassals are going to be well upset though because now we have three whole, now we have three duchies. Too many duchies, minus 15. Yeah. This guy shouldn't hate me. Oh, he hates me because I usurped his title. He actually likes me more than he did though. Um... Is not my de jure vassal. Literally untrue. You are literally my de jure vassal. Oh, wait. No, you're not. Because... Oh, you hold the Duchy of Pisa as well. Oh, right. So what's Tuscany? Where is Tuscany? Tuscany. Uh, okay. Well, I have some vassals in here who could hold it. I think I'm going to give... Wait, do you hold it directly? He does. Uh, I'm going to give Orbitello Tuscany. There we go. You can have Tuscany. Wonderful. So she thinks I'm great. Gave her a duchy title. Gonna cause some problems, but that's all fine. Right. So, let's continue. Demetrius came of age. Wonderful. He's not quite as good as his brother, but that's fine. He was never expected to be. He can marry himself off. Let's go find a... Well, we'll do the exact same thing. Inheritable traits. Some of all skills. Find him a nice carling to marry. Uh, these are people are all much older. 24? Pretty? Yeah, sure, you can marry this person. Sounds good. It's not a huge deal for me. It didn't even get us a um, an alliance, which is fine. Liberty faction disbanded. That's great to know. Right. Um, so this guy is close to me. See who else we can maybe grab in. This one? You would totally do it if you weren't at war. Who are you at war with? Calatra Calatrava. So what's the war for? Uh, the county of something in here. Can I just ask you to stop your war? Yeah, he hates me. He might ask for something in return. That's fine. Ask for money, please. That's fine. Yeah. I'll pay it. This guy likes me. Minus one opinion. Opinion. We can we can make this happen. Uh, sway. I might pay. My, I might just pay him a gift. How much does it cost? One fifty. We'll see which one comes quicker. But I think I'm gonna eat them up soon. My daughter will name her Catherine. Perfect. Uh, this person likes me. Great. Keep going. Actually, you know what we could do. There we go. 
Oh, wait, he won't quite accept yet, but he will accept once this uh, goes up for a little bit. Yeah, now he should accept. Nope, not quite. This hasn't ticked up at all. Not really. Okay. <laughs> That's fine. We'll let that continue. I just noticed all my commanders are improving. I'm on the wrong one. Perfect. Hey, we're above 30,000 troops now. Let's switch that over. Inheritance. I inherited a Tom. Okay. Uh, we have a child named Philippa. So what did we actually inherit? Oh, we inherited the other holding underneath the Ile de France. That's crazy. That's so good. Look at what we hold. That's actually nuts. What's our worst hold? I don't even know what our worst holding is. Because these are all within the Duchy of Brittany. Yeah, I think I have to give away something within Brittany. That's how bad it's got. I think I might have to give away this one. Alright. We're going to give away Leon. I could give it to my son. He Why does he inherit burn? Oh, he inherits, he inherits it from his mother. Um, I think I'm going to grant you... I'm going to grant you Leon. Try to figure out if that's going to be a major issue. Yes, it is, because he's going to split off. No, that's a terrible decision. The reason it's terrible is that will split, because uh, this is going to go to him. That that will split it off in weird ways. Uh, instead, I'm going to grant it to my brother, who's unlanded. Yeah, this guy. That seems good. I'm going to grant you Leon. He'll love it. He already likes me. Good. Right. That's a much better move on my part. You know, negotiate an alliance with them? Sure, why not? He, that means he can't join factions. Works for me. Hey, they named themselves Britannia now. Right. We're now at the right amount here. This should start making us money soon. Like at the end of the month. Pause. Uh, who are you? Um. Oh, right. You know who King Andre's real killer is. What do you want me to do? If I accept, she gains a weak hook on me. Sure. Whatever. That's fine. Um, I just want to see, like, minus six, you? Minus one, we're almost there. My last chance. This person decided their time in Paris has come to an end. All right, she wants me to press her claim on Alba. Yeah, uh, I don't do that sort of stuff. That's my mother left. She's like, press my claim or I'm leaving. All right, see ya. You know, no problem. Bunch more people just arrived with claims on all sorts of things. New new person with a claim comes around every day. Uh, you you want to join me yet? Minus one. What about the gift? How how are we looking on that? Gift is I haven't sent you a gift. Oh. Nah, we'll do it for free. That's fine. I'm I'm too cheap to send him a gift. Um, I'm going to upgrade that, sure. Make my army maintenance go down. I like that better. Hey, I can vassalize them for free. Nice. Look at that. We expanded. We didn't even need to spend any money. This one? You're not Catholic, unfortunately. Asturias, you think you're a king. You are not at war. You're Catholic. I'll send you a gift. 72 opinion. No, that'll do it. No, it won't. It'll put us one off again. Granada, six off. We're getting there. Algiers, you're at war. Um, you think that you're a queen? Okay. Pisa, you hate me for various reasons and you're at war. Um, okay, that's fine. Lombardy, you are at war. I might send you a gift anyway. Push you up by 47. Let's see where we're at. We're minus 10. Yeah, some of these we're definitely going to be able to eat soon. No problem. No problem. We're going to be good. Let's have a look here. Lawfully imprison my... Um... Oh, I just remember the brother tried to kill our mother. Oh, well. Whatever. I think Byzantine Empire just grew larger. <laughs> oh, dear. Right. Um, I'm going to keep some money for a little bit. Just to be on the safe side. I think we should be able to vassalize some people soon. Like, Renata is getting well close to vassalization for free. 
as are these guys. They're, they're like just on the edge of it. They would accept if they hadn't just started a war. Um, so I can get somebody's secret, but I or I can say forget all about it. Sure, whatever. I'll just gain opinion. It's fine. We have a lot of money. Social manipulation. First time it happened, I barely even gave it a moment stop, but my vassal has grown bolder as challenges no longer pass unnoticed. Um, so I guess he's self-conscious. So I need self-conscious, in power, or cowardly. Um, he would do everything in his power to get the task done. He's diligent, so this is the one I want to give him. That then gives me 50 the, uh, the diplomacy experience. I gained a hook on him. Perfect. That's what I'm looking for. It's going to tick up a little bit more and then we're going to almost get it. Nice. Call to war. Uh, to the bloody bloody blah. To the bloody bloody blah. You would like to press your claim on... You would like to press somebody's claim on the kingdom of Corsica. The Burgundian claim. On the kingdom of... The Burgundian claim. Wait, whose claim is it? Is it your claim? It is your claim. Oh yeah, I'm in. She wants to press her claim on Sardinia in Corsica. So you got 2,000, you got 16,000, so that's Orlean. Uh, you've got 14 by yourself, so if I take out Orleans, we should be fine. Uh, yeah, although actually I could just attack Corsica and be... Yeah, I can probably just attack Corsica. I'm in, by the way, just in case we were as any doubt. Let's rally point ourselves up here. Raise all armies on the rally point and then see how we're looking. Uh, merge on top of that. Yeah. Don't really know what you thought was going to happen there. We captured the queen. Well, that's uh, the shortest war I've ever been in. <laughs> right, merge. I'm just going to wait for them to end. So be it. Wait, pause, pause, pause. Disband for free. Who are you? Oh, you're these guys. I even won an alliance with you. How do I break this alliance? I can't because it's a marriage alliance. Ugh. Right. Um, Marshall's needed. 10 versus 21. I'll let my half-brother take that position. It's alright. Uh, let's see what we got. Uh, none of those I need to worry about. I bet if I spend some money, I can make some... Um, I can get some of it back in Pope taxes. As in, I'm taxing the Pope. There we go. Perfect. Um, so I could raise some troops over here. What was this war you got yourself into? A liberty war? I even care. I'm not, I do care because I can't do anything. Also, Burgundy is massive. When we eat them, it's going to be lovely. Uh, let's move this over here. I don't really want to be in your war. But hey, I'll raise my armies here. Cool. When when you're re all, all ready, merge over here. That's fine. Name you Patricia. That's my daughter-in-law. Okay, we're losing 20 a month, but that's fine. New perk available. Lovely. We take Thoughtful. That's kind of like the last one we need, I think. Although Foreign Affairs effectiveness is nice. Fellow Vast... Well, Independent Ruler Opinions, quite nice as well. Defensive Negotiations is actually huge for what we're doing, now that I think about it. Yeah, actually that one is huge. Because it makes them naturally like us. Hmm. Yeah, I should maybe take that and that, and then ditch Diplomacy. Or... I switch into here and try and make ourselves live forever. And living forever is nice because um, it's all going to go to our son anyway. It's all, it all trickles down to him. There's no issue. Yeah, I think we're fine. Anyway. Merge into a Doomstack. Walk Doomstack over. There we go. Yeah, do Doomstack's going to do what Doomstack's going to do. There we go. I'm gonna ransom this guy for 10 gold. Um, yeah, d just 27,000 over here, please. How do you, is there an assault in this game? I don't think there's assault. As in like a siege assault. 
I was just asking, because I know there is one in Crusader Kings 2. I don't think there is. No, I think it just happens automatically. Uh, my daughter's a fornicator. Alright. Sure, good for her. Lure of language. Sure, I'll try and get this one to happen. Did we learn the language this time? Or did we fail again? Miserably. Hey, we can ransom three people. Nice. Um... Who is the... Oh, you're down here? Where are you going? You're heading up this way? Just kind of curious where they're going. Yeah, I'll just gain stress. Oh, you're just landing here, are you? Alright. Uh, beat him up. We're overwhelmed by stress. Yep, you're right. We are. Over here? What's this one? Decision available found university. Whoa. Let, let's close all of these for a second. Why can I form a university? All capital counties without a university gain a best special building slot for university. Gain the nickname the scholar. Your level of fame is four or above. Uh, how much does it cost? It only costs 150 prestige. The province does not already have a special building slot. Did I inherit something or... What was this one? Siena. Oh right, that's Madrid, Siena. Alright, so universities can only be built in one of those. Yeah, sure, why not? I'll build a university. I'm now known as the scholar. A new age of knowledge is upon us. I've met with a steady stream of builders and scholars. And plans for the magnificent university are taking form. The master builder, or the build master, informs me that the brick for the university are ready to be laid. All that remains is a site and location and a name. University of Siena. So I am now Malik al Muluk Mejan, the scholar of the Bassa Empire. That's not a bad name, huh? Chase our way in here and win the war. Just, just catch him. Just catch him. But we'll get them eventually. This guy becomes a my friend, and we lose prestige. Sure. Oh, not prestige. Uh, stress. That's the word I was looking for. It was good. That's what I'm trying to get at. I'm not going to drink. I'm just going to gain stress. Right. Can the war end, please? Uh, sure. I'll do this one. Get 10 gold. Vassalize Count Gerlach. Or Gerlach. Sure. Can I... Can the war end, though? Hey, accepted it. Right. Gary here. Yeah, I see head over this way in Doomstack. Four months remain. Or here. Oh, my friend that I just got died. Wonderful. I need the war to end, though. Uh, at some point. A... We'll put in the powerful vassal, because he's got 11, which is fine. Here, uh, we can transfer people around. Sure, I'll transfer Gerlach in there. Makes the other guy like me more. Right. Child of my dynasty, Bridget. Okay. We're gaining ticking war score. We're going to gain more war score once the siege finishes, hopefully. Siege is finished. They're at 100%. I would like to disband my troops now. Thank you very much. Let me out of this war. Cool. Disband all. And I think I'm going to end the episode there. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.